Hey Cubers, it's me, Cube Master Lewis, and in case you didn't know, I'm a Boy Scout, and this summer was one of a kind for my troop. It started off with Camp Cherry Valley, but that's a topic for a future video. Later in the summer, a group of six scouts and four advisors met at LAX, ready for our expedition at Philmont Scout Ranch. The plane trip from Los Angeles, California to Denver, Colorado was only two hours. However, the bus ride from Denver to Cimarron, New Mexico was almost five. At one point on the bus ride, it started lightning and hailing. There was one bolt that struck frighteningly close to the bus. Strikes like these really made me realize how much lightning there is in this part of the country. Also on the bus, we were able to see the Air Force Academy, which was pretty cool. When we arrived, I'll call this day, day negative one. We saw a double rainbow, then ate at the Tooth of Time Trader's Cantina. We ate burritos called the bomb, and the next day, we knew why. Day zero is pretty chill, and I talked to some amateur radio guys who helped me on my way to getting my ham license. We also met a ranger, David. After we met David, we waited in a long line and took a group photo that looks kind of strange. On day one, we begin our trek. After loading up all of our packs onto a school bus, three rangers talked us through what to expect at Philmont. Then, they dropped the ten of us, plus David, in the middle of nowhere. David then proceeded to teach us how to triangulate so we would not get lost. We followed our navigation and ended up at Zaster Staff Camp. We took a 20 minute break there and ate pop tarts from the swap box. Then we left for Abreu. At Abreu, we got root beer and learned how to take care of a homestead. Then we got a tour of the house. The ceiling of the house is made of 10. Do any of y'all know why you'd be made of 10? Cause nine wasn't available. After Abreu, we stayed the night at the trail camp, Old Abreu, and I took one for the team and drank the chug jug, a soup of all the leftovers and the cold water used to clean the dishes. Yum. Day two, we packed our things and headed up a steep mountain for only two miles, but it was the equivalent of going up 70 flights of stairs across two miles with the 40 pound pack. However, near the end, we got to hike through the most beautiful meadow any of us had ever seen. However, there were cow pies everywhere. Our navigator for the day admitted he had no idea where we were or where we were going, but eventually we made it. We made it to Lower Bonito. So it's end card time. Thanks for watching. These videos take a long time to make, so it'd really help the channel if you click that like button. Also, this video is going to be the first in a series, so look out for more. Later, Cubers.